This is clearly a big factor. The Americans ended all their combat operations last December, so the fact that the Taliban were able to overrun a major city this week speaks volumes. Then the Taliban have a new leader, Mullah Akhtar Mohammed Mansour. They seem to have overcome differences following the death of the previous leader, and they may be rallying around the new man, giving the movement fresh impetus. But the Taliban have new rivals. The so-called Islamic State group has been making inroads in Afghanistan as it has elsewhere. Perhaps the Taliban feel the need to bolster their reputation. In Kunduz, they're even taking selfies. Afghanistan has been plagued by corruption. For years, many Afghans are sick of intimidation and lawlessness, things the Taliban promised to wipe out. And it was the very same promise that brought the Taliban to power in Afghanistan almost 20 years ago. Of course, an insurgency needs to fund itself. The Taliban's involvement in the opium trade is well known. But did you know that one of its allies, the Haqqani Network, also makes huge amounts of money from the perfectly legal sale of honey.